a tease of Mosul Sunni. Islamic State has also stepped up a bombing campaign in government-held areas in an attempt to relieve pressure on Mosul. The airstrike was followed by intense fighting in an eastern Mosul neighborhood where Iraq's special forces are slowly advancing toward the city center, hampered by suicide auto bombings, snipers fire, and concerns over the safety of civilians still living inside the city. The militias within Iraq are organized at least somewhat around a government ministry, though they largely operate independently, and their leadership is influential within Iraqi politics. Earlier this month, the bodies of at least 20 people killed by Islamic State were hung up across Mosul 5 crucified at a traffic junction, to warn residents against cooperating with the Iraqi military. The offensive began just over a month ago with a quick series of successful efforts to flush ISIS fighters out of villages on the outskirts of the sprawling city. In a nearby open market, now abandoned and pockmarked with bullet holes, flies buzzed around the bloodied body parts of ISIS fighters who killed themselves in a recent battle. Foreign Minister Frank Walter Steinmeier welcomed the gains against ISIL in the region surrounding the city but called for unity among the diverse population. The figure does not include the thousands of people rounded up in villages around Mosul and forced to accompany Islamic State terrorists to cover their retreat towards the city as human shield s. At the moment there might not be any need for that. But if we are ever required to collaborate with anyone outside our borders for the protection and defense of Iraq, we are ready to work across the continents and seas. Mosul fell to days two years ago, when the terror outfit began its campaign of death and destruction in northern and western Iraq. Thanks for viewing this tease. Sign up for the Tip Top Tech channel or search for a tease Second Mind on YouTube to find and then enjoy other teas.